guys welcome or welcome back to another video here on my channel this is my third time filming this video and this is a teen wall my third time saying this the first time I filmed it I did it with just pulling the stuff off the bag and opening it on bag but it's a lot of plastic honestly and opening the thing and I looked at my time and I was almost 30 minutes into the video and I wasn't even halfway through the bag because I was taking so much time opening up the plastic then when I filmed it again I thought maybe I should do it like in an ASMR version and speak lowly and just let the plastic rattle and you know like ASMR and when I played it back I only I filmed like a little bit maybe like five or six minutes and played it back to here I don't know I wasn't really feeling it I don't know but so I decided to just open everything so I can get through everything faster so this video isn't 40 minutes long because I don't think anybody's gonna sit and watch a 40 minute video you know so I opened everything I looked at everything I did not compare what I got to what was on my um, item order list my bag did have a hole in it when I got it and so some stuff could have fell out and I don't know but I will compare it and I'll let you know if I actually did receive everything not everything I ordered was nail stuff but I'm only going to show you the nail stuff and I'm going to group it in sections so first let's start out with the nail stickers I got some nail stickers They're the same ones as the ones before. These little pink ones, these are very cute. And then these ones are meant to look like an airbrush effect around the nails. Let's see. See, it's like plastic on plastic on plastic on plastic. But yeah, they look like this and they're meant to like give like an airbrush effect actually these will look very cute with these nails but in, in the middle of like the aura design that will look cute but those were nail stickers so now let's move on to chrome powders I got three oh, I got four sorry this one just kind of hard to tell This one would look which looks exactly the same so I might have got two of the same one this one and then a little palette and one broke this one broke but I really wanted it for these gold cool ones these gold cool colors so that's okay next that I have next to me are glitters these glitters all came in a set all together I apologize, I apologize if I'm moving a little quickly. I just don't want this video to be super long, but you do have an option in the settings to slow down the video if you need to. And all these glitters came together. This one is cracked. This, but they all came together. Purple is very pretty. So I would like for you guys to in the comments below give me a suggestion on how to use these so I I have maybe I have some glitters like these but they're in like little tiny two little tiny jars and I've used them but when you put the top coat on them I feel like it takes away so do I just put those on there and don't top coat my nails or should I maybe get like a clear poly gel and encapsulate it I'm not a poly gel girl but I will learn if I need to so just let me know next let's start off with nail excess like nail gems and things like that which that's the bulk of this video and after that the last thing we'll show I will show is nail tools so we got some Karomi and Hello Kitty 
Sanrio, if you don't know what Sanrio is. Hello Kitty is part of the Sanrio family. You probably know who Hello Kitty is. You may not know the rest of the characters, but you probably know Hello Kitty. And underneath my nail, it's not dirt, it's foil, gold foil. I can't get it off. <laughs> I actually have some more. I think they're, these characters are part of Sanrio too. I do not know all the Sanrio characters. But these ones are meant for like necklaces and stuff. You can see they give you a, it's like a little circle. So I have to break that off before I put it on the nails. But yeah, there's that. And we have these big charms. I thought it would be cute to do like a candy nail set. Very cute. Some bows in different colors. Some more bows. Which I, I'm glad I took all the plastic off everything because I'm moving way faster. But bows and pearls. Nice little coquette nail set would be very cute. Oh, this one I didn't take the plastic off yet. That's okay. I thought I could do like a Las Vegas Atlantic City theme nail set. So when I saw these, I was like, oh, that's cute. Some little gummy bears in various colors. Some clear like raindrops. I did do a raindrop nail set. If you didn't see that video, please go watch it. And let me know in the comments below which nail you like the best because I wasn't sure how to do raindrop nails so I was looking for some feedback in the video so go check the video out now we have all of the gems that's in these little bags I have cherries pink and red some of them are like they're turned around so red cherries pink cherries these little hearts let me see if I can get up close these zodiac pieces if you watch any of my other videos I do do a zodiac nail set for every zodiac the Taurus nail set went up last week last Sunday so please go check that out some emerald pieces the birthstone for May is emerald so you'll be saying these again you only got three so that's okay some lips some little gems I hate that they put the the sticker the tape on there so you can't even it's hard to see let's see if I can open this and um, maybe I can just move it to the side mm, there we go some ducks some bees because I did want to do a bumblebee nail set you know these ones let's see those are pretty moons and stars little hearts Some fuzzy hearts. And some smiley faces on flowers. And lastly for those, some um, some more of those gems, like the emerald ones, but in pink. So then I got these two. They're not the same, they're different. The first one looks like this. They both have these little lollipop ones in there. These little tiny, tiny lollipops. Some gummy bears. Little bows and uh, like pearl 
some pearl bowls. Those are cute. These little animals. Look at that. That's a bear. Some of these like fuzzy, like candy looking pieces. And some hearts. Some more hearts. I like how it's color, like color cool. Like green, green, purple, purple. I like that. And then this one, which is similar. This one also has gummy bears, but it has multicolored gummy bears and it has little lollipops. But this one has candy in it, like little candy pieces. And I also got some black bows and stuff, some black charms in this one. Look at the little ice cream. So nice. These are like the same in the, uh, the other one. That's okay. And I got these little black. I don't have any black charms or anything like this, so this is very nice. I like these. I really do. And then I got some silver caviar beads. All my caviar beads that I own currently are gold and some more pearls. And I got this set of gems in many different colors. If you hear background noise, it's uh, the game, like the PlayStation. And then these, because I have a mic connected to my phone, which is what I'm filming on, and it's like picking up all the sound came okay, like this and lastly 13 minutes in I'm making good time I got three of this or four of the same charm so I got these so I have these I have, I have four of them, so can you tell I really like them? So I have them in gold, purple, pink, and green. Should I open these? So now let's move on to the, well, I have nail tips. I didn't realize that I, I did buy nail, I bought nail tips. So I have some nail tips, so let's show those. I got some duck nail tips, y'all. Duck nails are making a comeback. Honestly, to be honest with you, when I think duck nails, nobody in my life growing up, I don't ever remember wearing duck nails. I do remember seeing them on people, but I remember Trisha Paytas, like back then Trisha Paytas with her duck nails. And I I got these because I see that a lot of people are doing duck nails now. And I was like, oh, I wanna try. So I got full cover ones. <laughs> they look ridiculous, but you know, I mean, if you like duck nails, no shade or nothing, but yeah. They look ridiculous to me, as me being honest. I got some more nail tips. These ones are also duck nails, but they are short duck nails. They look better. These definitely look better. Like, I think I will wear these. I'm gonna have these short almond ones. It says no need to file. This looks like something you can get from Sally's. <laughs> like the packaging, doesn't it? Okay, so they are etched on the inside. 
see it's like foggy they're etched on the inside but that is very sh <laughs> that's very very short okay we will see how those work out for us and then the last ones I got was these um, full cover tips and they are I'm guessing it's just square coffin shape but they're short ones too I don't know why they say extra long maybe extra long in the the nail bed is extra long because these are not long but okay now the nail tools and then that's it first nail tool or nail accessory whatever is this little picture for pictures so you put on your wrist and then you take your nail photos you take them like this or you have it on your hand like this you know you have the little the lacy part or whatever I don't know it just gives it a little bit more maybe you can like this I don't know but I thought it was cute next I got these little tabs and these are to hold your um, nails onto your nail stand so if you use a nail stand if you use a nail stand like this you can put the tabs on the stand and it'll hold your your tips on there okay I got a new um, silicone rubber rubber nail picker because the one that I do have it is really difficult to pick things up with now I think it's just worn out but yeah and I didn't have any extra tips because the one I have uh, this one too you can screw it on and off but I didn't have any extra ones to like put so I just bought a new one some sculpting gel A new nail palette. I have like six of these now. You can never go wrong. You can never have too many of those things. This, which you can take pictures of your nail sets on, you lay your nails out and you just take a cute little photo of the set. These, which are for, well, you can use them for anything, but you would glue one side of the magnet on your nail, the other side of the magnet on the gem or the rhinestone or the nail accessory whatever and it will spin so if I took I don't know one of these big ones which I think would be cool for and I put it on my nail with one of these it would spin so I can spin it while it's on my nail but it would be cute and I got this which is just to pick up polish and do like a ombre look or airbrush effect something like that and it came with a picker I've seen these on Korean nail sites and I just never bought one so it comes with a little picker like this and it just holds it and then you can You know, and then you can always reuse it. I wouldn't just throw this away because you can always switch it to another side and then use it. But I thought that was cool. I don't know. Is that weird or is it cool? And the last thing is some new nail art brushes. Because if you're like me, sometimes you forget to clean out the gel out of your brush. And then it gets cured into your brush. And now you have a brush that you can't use. Although you can buy like a little comb or something to clean out your brushes. So I got some pink brushes and they look like all different lengths. 
I have a nail set, nail brush set that's just like this, but they're black. These are pink. So that is everything that I got from Timu. I hope you enjoyed the video. If I move too fast, let me know if you would prefer a longer video of me just actually unwrapping it or something like ASMR style where I'm not talking and you just hear the plastic just rattling or moving around. Let me know if you would enjoy that or should I just do two versions and do like an ASMR version and a non-ASMR version because I know not everybody likes ASMR. Me personally, I love ASMR, but just let me know what you enjoy. If you would enjoy a longer version of the video of me just kind of like talking about the gems and what I would do a nail set with, what I would use them for, then, you know, just let me know. Leave me suggestions, feedback, all of that in the comments below. It's greatly appreciated. Thank you so much for watching. Check out my Taurus nail set, which went up last week. And my new nail schedule, my new video schedules, I upload a video every Sunday, only on Sundays. So just a video one day a week, every Sunday. So every Sunday, check back here to catch another video. I'm going to try to upload a video around, I want to say between 11 a.m. and 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So somewhere around there, the new videos will go up every Sunday. So subscribe, like the video, comment below, any suggestions, how's the audio, how's the quality, all of that stuff like that. It's like I said, it's really appreciated for feedback to just help me be better. And thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you or you'll see me in the next video.